here on the farm. Uh, we're up to this little spot right here, which is uh, a lid. Anybody know what it is? Let's go inside. Okay. Okay. Here is actually, and I'm gonna get in closer, see if you can see it. This is water. And this is um, a 55 gallon drum and coming in right here, let me, let me reach back out. Coming in right here is, no, no, no. Coming in the lower part, this one right here, water is coming in from my house and it's from the shower, it's from the sink, it's from a uh, kitchen sink and it's also from washing machine. This second one is if the water gets too high, it will go there and it will go out to my drain field, which will be um, uh, my, my septic. So my idea is, here we go, you ready? My idea is I have a sump pump and it will turn on when this goes up high. What, listen to this, it turns on. I just, I just did it once. Now this lid is just there to, to keep it on top and make it kind of look pretty good. Now, the issue I have is this pump is a three quarter pump or a half pump and it was a cheap one that I bought online. I do not suggest it. However, I have ordered a new pump which is coming in today and it will be a um, one and a half horsepower. Now, uh, it's going to go to a three quarter. Three quarter is what it's going to go to. But actually, I'm going to probably redo this whole thing and I'll, I'll, I'll show you when it happens. The idea is to bring it to a three quarter and right here is a check valve. Now, check valve basically is water can go this way. It can't go back. So when the pump turns on, it pumps everything out. And by pumping everything out, it will not, uh, it, there will no, be very little backwash. So the idea was to go here, and if you, if you notice right here, I undid it just to, just to get the water out. The pump that I had, it was connected here. The pump, the pump I have right now cannot push the water up this hill all the way up because this is gray water, which will be uh, supplying my rainbow eucalyptus tree. This is one of them. And this is, uh, actually that's just a eucalyptus. And this is a rainbow eucalyptus tree, which I've got uh, covered just now. And if you look closely, it actually looks kind of beautiful. Yeah. Um, it's a little cold out and I, I just, I want to save them. I want to make sure they get through this year. If they get through this year, they'll, they'll be fine. Usually it's a couple of, uh, of years. And if you look, look how tall they are. It's about 20 feet high. So this is going to be the forest, the rainbow eucalyptus forest. And the idea is to get the water to come all the way up to here, which is the top part, and then drain down throughout the entire forest. And, and basically I'm gonna have uh, about 40, 40 rainbow eucalyptus. The pump I have, which is three quarter, could only make it to about right here. The, the new pump, which is gonna be a horse and a half, is gonna make it all the way to the top. And then basically it's gonna get to the top point and then I know that it, gravity will feed it down because this is on a hill. And that is gray water supplying uh, my rainbow eucalyptus trees here on the farm.